presence of the living God. We are speaking on the gates, the twelve gates, and um, for more is the ten, the tiende in all. So see all the tiende via. Let us pray about gates, the gates. Wow, the gates of the new Jerusalem. And John was told, "Come up here and let me show you the bride." And then he saw a city. So the city is the bride. Now I saw by a means of what was for. Die nieuwe city om jy nog te kom. So as hulle wacht, dan mis hulle die inheritance wat die Heere vir hulle wil gee. Toe hy dit 2000 jaar teruggebring het. Want hy het ons die bruid gemaakt. Hy men en hy is ons man en hy is ons husband. So, dis is die tiende video en ons praat vanmorgen oor Naftali. Ek het so lang gewag, ek het al so, kyk elke kyk, is so awesome. En ek is so opgewonne oor hierdie kyk, dit, Eddie, dit infiltreer my spirit, my mind. Ek, ek, dit doen iets aan my. Dit is net awesome, hierdie, hierdie woord. En ek het al so drie, ek denk so drie, kyk terug, kon ek nie wag in Naftali nie. Awesome, man, awesome. Naftali beteken obtain by wrestling. Wow. Obtain by wrestling. So ek wil hy julle met julle bybels oopmaak en dan gaan ons saam lees en ek wil hy kare met vir my Genesis 49 vers 21 toe gaan. Obtain by wrestling. Naftali. En daar is 12 seens, al 12 seens, was die seens van van Jacob, maar Jacob sy naam het verander na Israel toe, so Israel het twaalf seens gehad, en die twaalf seens was die twaalf stamme gewees, en toe op, toe John die guides sien, toe sien hy elke guide, van die nieuwe Jerusalem, the bride, the lamb's wife, op elke guide entering place, sien hy een naam, en die naam beteken iets, awesome, daar is een revelation in die naam, dis ook om ons die naam en bestudeer, want die Heere wil vir die kerk iets sê, vir die wife iets sê, dat as jy hier die revelation krijg van hier die ou, sy karakter en sy naam en wie die tribe was, then you can enter into this guy and be part of the glory of God. En dis ook om ons gaan kyk, die first one, was roepen om te hulle toe ons, we must behold the sun. So to be part with the glory of God, you must always behold the son of God, Jesus Christ. En so het ons afgegaan en afgegaan en afgegaan, en elke boetie was so awesome gewees, awesome gewees. Nou hierdie boetie, love ek, want ek het experiences in hierdie boetie, he who wrestle, he that obtains by wrestling, En ek gaan vanmorgen vir jou iets sê, wat die kerk gaan sjok. Gaan sjok. Rondom wrestling. Want jy weet nie dit nie. Jy weet nie dit nie. Daar is een wrestling in die spirit, wat jy nodig het. Wat jy moet doen, to enter, and to be part of God's glory. So, Karin lees vir my Genesis 49, vers 21. Naftali is a hind let loose. He giveth goodly words. Alright. Lees het weer, lees het mooi hard weer en sta daar. Naftali is a hind let loose. Hind. A hind is a female deer. Alright. Die profetiese woord vir a female deer, die die symboliek daarvan beteken a mighty man. Alright. A mighty man, let loose. 
Naftali means he who obtains by wrestling. Let loose. Wow. <laughs> he, Naftali, obtains by wrestling. Let loose. And we're done. He giveth goodly words. All right. And give goodly words. Oh. There is so awesome revelations in that. So awesome, and I can't wait for me to pray for me. All right, so Eddie, I will let you know from my intimate day six to come, and I can't wait for us to read. Then read act the way I know intimate day six to read act for you like a solemn, eighteen verse three and thirty. Where is it? He makes my feet like hinds' feet. A hind is a bull. It's a female deer. Able to stand firmly. So what is kostbaar van a hind? A hind is a deer en hulle loop in berge. Het jy al gesien waar staan hinds? Het jy al gesien waar staan deers? Jy kan nie glo dat daai bok op daai rotsachtige plek kan opklim of loop. Ek my neem die videoclip sien wat op YouTube is van hinds. It's, it's amazing. Hoor jy so? He makes to stand me firmly. So what the Yerah say each for the high is each move to stand firmly. Make it move. Or make progress on dangerous heights of testing and trouble. So alright, it makes my feet stable. Very important. But then is that each to do with testing. Testing. All right, the height it is to do with stable. It is to do with testing and trouble. He sets me securely upon high places. All right. So now, Tali, to I have born a word. What say the ma and Jacob, the pa Israel? To all of the kind, kind to say, ah, here it can. Sal soos a hind wees. But, let loose. Omtou, hulle het geweet wat hulle name beteken. Hulle was nie soos my pa en my ma, en sê, Martin is een mooie naam, kom ons noem my Martin nie. In die oud testament was, om name te gee, was precious en kostbaar. Dit was wel een baie belangere. Dit moes iets sê van hierdie kind. Dit moes een karakter gee. Dit moes sy personality gee. Dit moet sy, sy, sy bediening uitwees, dit moet sy purpose bring. En wat so snaaks is, is dat die kinders het exactly in hulle karakter eindskappe geloop. Maarten beteken warrior, en van kleins af vrou my ma, het ek, was ek een strijder en een bekleier. <laughs> en ek kon nooit verstaan, hoe kom wil ek so fight nie, en as ek nou nog weide wat wil, so ek het nog daar keus ook gedraam. Wrestling. He that obtains by wrestling. So it's point in. On top. Obtained by wrestling. But feet like hinds make me stable and something to taste. Something to taste. All right. Tasting of trouble. All right. Mark it more up when the revelation can enter. Come. All right. Eddie. Lees vir ons in 1 Timotheus 6 vers 12 en ek wil lee, hy moet baie starig lees want ek gaan omstop. Want ek gaan vir julle weis, kyk, elke woord in die oud testament het skryf Christ. Because the written word is Christ. The written word is the living word and the living word is Christ. The word of God is Jesus Christ. So in die oud testament het hulle iets geskryf. En ons weet net nie hoe kostbaar en hoe diep goed is nie. Maar we, watch nou, ek het vir julle iets gelees van Genesis 9 verag rondom Naftali. Nee, en ek het vir julle Psalm 18, een Psalm van David iets gelees van een haand. Alright, en ek het vir julle kies gegeen, edit, shoot, stadig. Fight the good fight of faith. Right, fight the good fight of faith. He shall be called Naftali, he who thanks by wrestling. Fight the good fight of faith. 
Lay hold on eternal life. Lay hold on eternal life. Het jy al wrestlers gesien? Het jy al gesien hoe sterk hulle is? En hoe hulle lyk? Hulle is goed gebou, want hulle fight baie, hulle wrestle baie. They wrestle because they want to obtain glory. Alright? Where unto thou art also called and has professed a good profession before any witnesses. Alright. You are called to lay hold on eternal life. Hey man, I say fight the good fight. This is some of my name, hey, I have belief in faith, nie? <laughs> and all is come to my thing, nie? Die Heere sê vir more, gloe jy, en ek sê, ek gloe, en ek sê, mooi my kind kom sit, jy kom saam met my roe. Nee, nee, hy sê, do you behold me? Yes, Lord, I behold you. Do you have an ear? Yes, Lord, I have an ear to hear. So is it, are you intertwined with me? Yes, Lord, I'm intertwined with you. Hierdie, do you agree with me? Yes, Lord. Can you praise me? Are you a true worshipper? Yes, Lord, I'm a true worshipper. Do you know that you must be in me like I'm in you? Yes, Lord. Are you content that I'm your reward? Yes, Lord. I, you, I'm content with this faith. In fact, fortunate. Mary Hart, all right, obtain by wrestling. Fight the good fight of faith. Lay hold. Jy sê vir iemand, lay hold. Vir iemand wat dit moet graas. Moet wrestle. Eternal life. Eternal life. En dan wil ek, Eddie, lees weer vir my die tweede gedeelte, hoor hy so. Where unto thou art also called. You are called. Yes, and done. And thou profess the good profession for many witnesses. Where he? To profess to prove as a good witness to many. Alright, we're mooi, we're mooi. Ek skryf hier so, met ander woorde, Naftali beteken obtain by wrestling. To lees ons van die hands feet wat stable is. Op high places, die Heere wil jou stable maak. Alright, stand firmly. Dit het te doen met overkam, want die hand moet let loos, moet losgeraak word. Het something to do with testing. Alright, het something to do to prove. Wat hy het gelees, so dat jy geproof word amongst the witnesses. Luister hier so, jylle sal glad nie vir my luister, as ek nie kan proof. As ek die gospel nie kan proof nie, luister niemand nie, dit is hoe dit werk. So daar is a wrestling betrokke to proof yourself and for others that you have obtained it. Alright. And then let loose. Jy kan nie losgeraak gemaakt word as jy getest word. Nou, Lamele het een test geskryf hierdie aflope tyd. Toe kry jy een rapport. Die rapport sê, Lamele was been tested, and this is the proof that he has it. The knowledge. Is dit so? Is dit een rapport? Rapport is die proof dat hy getest was and I have the knowledge. Pak het sin. Alright. Ok. Het hy dit net gekry, of was dat bykie wrestling betrokke, om die knowledge te kry? En hy goed. You see there is something in God. Fight the good fight of faith. Faith and belief, en die gaan nie net wees wat ek sê vir jou iets, en jy sê, well ok, I believe in. And that settles it. There is a fight. When I feel it's on prod, 
wat baie moeilik om te glo, gaan na fight betrokken wees binnen jou, en saam men, is fighting for many years, to, to be let loose, but when they are let loose, is the, is the rapport, van dat hulle geproef, dat hulle getest is, is daar nie dan, wat het sin bede, Ik ben die klim groot, maar jullie is my slim mense. Ek ben die Edison geneer, ek behoort die verslaan wat ek sê. Sê sjo? Ja, ek sê de Lord. Revelation 20 vers 4, en is jy thuis daar. Karin gaf vir ons Revelation 20 vers 4 lees. Wat is so? And I saw thrones. I saw thrones. And they sat upon them. Yes, and they sat upon them. So it's people that sat upon the throne. Onthou, ons is in Revelation 20. John was in the spirit and he saw thrones. Not a throne, thrones. And they that sat upon the thrones. Yes. And judgment was given unto them. And judgment was given unto them. And I saw the souls of them that were beheaded for the witness of Jesus. And I saw the souls that were beheaded. Now, now, from the begin of Revelation of as John it seen, and say I seen Canalara, then say the Canalara is the church. Jesus Christ stands in the middle of the church. And not say the kind of lare oil, and I see fuckles, and I see flames of fire, and he says the lare is like wool, and his feet is like iron and brass. It's like light, 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 and to say symbolic of things. Now, here I saw thrones. Thrones betekent authorities. And I soon see men set it on this. Thrones, authority. Alright. Those men whose heads were beheaded for the witness of Christ. Eddie, what betekent that? Physis. Now, where is your mind? Where is your flesh? Where is your problem? Man's problem is yourself. Let me tell you, your problem is your mind. Your greatest enemy is your mind. Let me tell you, if you can lose your mind for Jesus Christ and get his mind, the mind of Christ, then you are the man that are beheaded for the witness of Jesus Christ. Alright. Alright, hang on. And for the word of God, your head is, be, is been headed for the word of God. Meaning that there is a wrestling betrokken. Can you wrestle with God? And we had not worshipped the beast, <coughs> neither his image, neither had received his mark upon their foreheads, or in their hands, and they lived and reigned with Christ a thousand years. Alright, so met ander woorde, hier is mense wat authority sê, wat sien ek wees vir julle die braad. The wife, the church, that shines the glory of God. They are the men that are beheaded, that does not have their own minds of Christ. Oh, their own minds, but they have the minds of Christ. Yeah. They do not have the mark of the beast. But the beast is natural earthly power. Yeah. Now for 2000 jaar terug was daar een ander beest. Daar was een Romeinse empire. So die hele boek openbaring praat van een Romeinse empire as die beest. As jy iets lees van die beest in openbaring, Romeinse empire. But we are 2000 years further. So we have other beasts trying to control us. But the people that doesn't have the mind of Christ, they are actually under the mind and the power of this earthly power. But as jy onder hierdie earthly power is, dier sy merk te dra op jou mind en jou hande werk, 
dan kan je niet zo'n Christus rule niet. Verstaan je leed beeldspraak? Maak ik voor jullie zin? Ze is ek praat. Alright, they were beheaded. Right, Revelation 12 vers 11. Edi, wat het jy daar? Ek kies dan voor, ek kan nie sien wat. As kies. Revelation 12 vers 11 en Koren gaan vir my na Genesis 32 vers 24 toe. En wat die een, King James of... Lees maar vir my, ga maar amplified, is recht. And they have overcome. They, they, as people, have overcome. Him, by means of the blood of the Lamb. Him, where is of his him, Satan, want die die gaan oor, they fought with the dragon. Alright? And they, men, have overcome Satan, by the blood of the Lamb. Sit ek en jy vandag hier so, with the blood of the Lamb. Yes. And by the utterance of their testimony. Okay, the word of their testimony. Jy oorwin die vijand by that which you confess. For they did not love and cling to life even when faced with death. They did not love life. Alright? Want lees weer die stikkie. Okay. Uh, for they did not love and cling to life even when faced with death. They did not cling to their life. You see men with this spirit that wrestles, that understand, fight, a good fight of faith. Faith and belief has something to do with fight. It's something to do with wrestling. But that wrestling is good for you because the reward is let loose. Because a hind wants to get let loose. But first, voor jy tek losgelaat word, moet jy geproef word. Jy moet getest word. En al hoe jy getest word, is dier a struggling to, a struggling in te gaan, of in a wrestling in te gaan, to obtain to show yourself a proof and to others. Do you think, do you think it's all Christians that are going to reign with Christ? Karen, here's from my Genesis 20, verse 15. Where is so? And Jacob was left alone. Alright, first I'll ask you, Jacob is now the father of Naftali. Nee, sy naam is Miss Israel, maar nou is sy nog Jacob, hoor jy so. And then wrestled a man with him until the breaking of the day. Alright, they wrestle a man, or in other translations, an angel, with him, until the breaking of day, by belangrike punt. And when he saw that he prevailed not against him, Jacob sien, hy kan nie hierdie angel wen nie. He cannot prevail against him. He touched the hollow of his thigh. The angel touched the hollow of his thigh. And the hollow of Jacob's thigh was out of joint. Yes. As he wrestled with him. As he wrestled with him, yes. And he said, let me go for the, for the day breaker. And he said, I will not let thee go and except thou bless me. For the day breaketh, I will not let you go until you bless me. He wrestled with an angel of God. He wrestled with God. Until God let him loose or blessed him. But where is so? The angel het hom geslaan op die jip, so dat hy nie meer menselike ding moet voortbring nie, but that which must be inherent, must be a God thing. Jacob het man geloop, vir die rest van sy leven, to show the proof that he was being tested of God 
and that which he produced is now from God. That's why obtained by wrestling. That's why it's a game. You must be tested. You must wrestle with God. Sometimes it's going to cost you a wrestling. And I can't honor how you feel for daily who wrestle. Where is so? 2 Corinthians 4. Verse 7. But we have this treasure in earthen vessel that the excellency of the power may be of God and not of us. Why did the angel or Jesus Christ hit Jacob when he wrestled with him? Sweat that very so. That the treasure in earthen vessel, that the excellency and the power may be of God and not of us. So, wanneer ons wrestle with the Heere, dan verloor ons onszelf in die ding. Ons verloor ons power. Ons verloor ons ding. Want we are wrestling with God. And some people wrestle with God for many years. To obtain this glory. To let loose. Heere, wanneer gaan jy hierdie ding doen? En jy bid vir jare, Heere, Heere, Maar wanneer jy so bid, Heere, ek bid al vir so vir jare, ek riesel met jy, verloor jy jouself. Until the breaking of day. Het sy gelees, until the breaking of day. Alright. Toe slaan hem op die thai, so dat Jacob nie een natural ding moet voortbring nie, maar een proof moet wees, dat dit wat hy nou gaan voortbring, want op die hiet hy nog die kinders nie. Gaan God lief wees, en nou verander sy naam, na Israel toe, die angel sê, hy sluit om op die thaar, hy sê, wat is jou naam? En hy sê, my naam is Jacob, hy sê, jou naam sal nie met Jacob wees, hy sê, jou naam gaan nou Israel wees. Give him a new name, because you have wrestled with God, and you have won. You have wrestled with God and you have won. Well, where is all? Karen, lees die laaste stikkie weer until the breaking of day. And he said, let me go for the day breaker. Yes, let me go for the day breaker. Weet jylle wanneer sy let loose? When the day breaker. Kom, ek lees vir julle 2 Petrus 1 vers 19. O, hier is diep. Hier is diep. Hier is te diep. Wat dan is jou? Hier is te diep vir een normale ou. So lang jylle net bijblij. We have also a more sure word of prophecy. We have also a more sure word of prophecy. Where unto ye do well that ye take heed take heed of this as unto a light that shineth in a dark place until the day dawns and the day star arise in your hearts we see day star Christ in your hearts day star must arise in your heart when a day star arise in your heart beteken, jy found the light in earthen vessel, in a dark place. Wat beteken dit? You are let loose. But first, you are going to be proved. First, you are going to be tested by God. And you are going to wrestle with God for this thing. Wrestle with God. But your feet must be firm to rule with Christ. Your feet must be like a hind's feet, but wants to get loose. But you need to wrestle, obtain the glory by wrestling with God until you set loose. We have, but we have this treasure 
in earthen vessel. Earthen vessel is a body, and I have a treasure inside of me. That the excellency and the power might be of God. God is inside of me. Christ is inside of me. It's a light wants to come out, and not of us. To Yisak, we have also more more sure word of prophecy. Where unto ye do well that ye take heed, as unto a light that shineth in a dark place. The dark place is your body, but the light shining in a dark place until the day dawns. And Jacob wrestled with the angel of God until the breaking of day, until Christ was revealed. Until he was blessed, until the hind feet were loosed, let loose to glory, or to enter the gate. What is brought for a gate? Hallelujah. Jan Korintus 9 vers 24 en 27 is daar en daar. En dan, ok, Edik lees vir my, ja, En dan kan Koren nou hoor, vir Salom 102 toe gaan. 24 tot 27. Lees om maar nie King James. Know ye not, that they which run in a race, run all, but one receiveth the prize. So run, that ye may obtain. Alright, run, that ye may obtain. Weet jy nie, ons allemaal run nie. Maar allemaal kry nie prijs nie. Paul sê dit. Ek men, ons kyk aan dit tip. Is daar een ouwe die prijs kry? Yes. Daar is een ouwe wat vir die geit staan. Een ouwe wat God gaan ressel until the breaking of day. Until Christ is shined. Until your feet are set loosed. Where is so? Eddie, wat is jy daar? Net een op tuin. Op tuin by wrestling. Le gaan jou beste gee, gaan aan. And every man that striveth for the mastery is temperate in all things. Now they do it to obtain a corruptible crown, but we an incorruptible. Hey, the wrestling wat ons dier gaan, is for incorruptible crown. Iets wat ewig geworde het. Paulus sê hier so man, kyk na die atlete en sê, kry allemaal prijse, nee. Hy sê maar 10 hardloop in die baan, maar net een kry die prijs. Hy sê maar hulle probeer die prijs kry van corruptible things. But we must fight the good fight of faith. We must obtain it by wrestling. Because not all is going to receive it. It's only those who fight the fight. I therefore so run, not as uncertainly, so fight I, not as one that beateth the air, but I keep under my body and bring it into subjection, lest that by any means, when I have preached to others, I myself should be a castaway. Thy last stick is so that I am not a castaway, is so that I am proved that I have wrestled with God. Eddie, lees net vir my, weer die laaste versie, want ek het, ek wou iets te sê. But I keep under my body, I keep, ja, and bring it into subjection. Daar sê, bring my body under subjection. Hey man, those who are beheaded for Christ, those who lose their life, those that did not cling to their life, those who wrestle, those who obtain by wrestling, those who are proved, those who are test, until they are let loose like a hind's feet. It's not all men that will receive. You must be headed. You must lose your mind. You must lose your will. And when they fight, word they stacker in the year, and you, before that you lose the mark, word, word that is. Jy word geslaan. Dis ek om baie mense wat die Heere soek mank loop. Baie mense wat die Heere soek loop mank. Jy kan nie saam met hom roel nie. In sy presence kan jy inkom as jy beleef. 
He said, dear, and I said, all those who believe enter in his gates, and you say, yes, thank you, by his grace. But Eddie, to sit with him in heavenly places, and to rule with him, and to have the same glory and authority and power as our Lord Jesus Christ, you must behold him. You must have an ear. You must be intertwined. You must know that you are content with him. He's your rewarder. You must have a merry heart with your feet dipped in oil. You must be brave. Fortune. You must be a brave man to fight with him. You must lose your life. You must wrestle. You must show proof. Mark it say. And, and Karen, Psalm 102, verse 20 and 21. Where is it? To hear the groanings of the prisoner. Ooh. <laughs> to hear the groanings of the prisoners. Groanings. Weet you what's groanings? A vrouw wat een geboorte is, wat geboorte nou moet gee, groan. Ek gaan onthou toe Karin vir Zia moes kry. Nou groan sy daar, nou is ek hier so, want die, die dokters is daar, en, 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 die, en die, die sisters is daar, en ek praat oor hoe God, hoe groot die Heere is, en TV Joshua toe ek daar was, hoe het ek geboorte gesien, sonder pijn en leiding, en het my so voor my oog gebeur, en God is great, en hulle, is it? Yes! Wow, wow, wow! And say, so, ooh, ooh! So you say, no, no, shut up, Martin! Ooh! Ek is opgewonde, ek preach vir die dokter en die sisters is so. Who great God heal and miracles do, and say, ooh, ooh, ooh! And say, wel, geboorte gee, she wants to let loose. She wants to, to have Christ. She wants to obtain but first she wrestles before she obtains. Listen, the groanings of the prisoners. Let me tell you, we are, as children of God, are present. Maybe you are not present of sin anymore, but you are a prisoner of God. And some things you are going to wrestle to obtain. Where is so? To lose those that are appointed to death. Lose those who are appointed to death. We talk about life, immortality, life, and eternal life. Let me tell you, for 2,000 years already, have no one ever break through. Do you know why? Because they do not confess it, they do not speak it, they do not wrestle. The groanings for those who are pointed to death, who are present, Hold on. To declare the name of the Lord in Zion and praise in Jerusalem. To declare, praise in Jerusalem. To declare the Lord in Zion. What is it Zion? What is Zion? Zion is the, the church. It's the church. It's the city. To declare the Lord, there's it via. To declare the name of the Lord in Zion. I want to declare the name of the Lord here in this church. Yes. And his praise in Jerusalem. And his praise. I want to praise him. How come? Because he have heard my groanings. My groanings. My wrestling with him to make me loose. Set me loose of this prison I am in. Let me tell you, ek is al 21 jaar in die min ministry om anointing te obtain. Is jy net nie? It's going to cost you something. Dis jy net, mense, ek is heel dag in die woord. Ek mediteer in die woord. Ter die nacht in die dag, in die nacht in die dag. My woord, my spirit is consume. Ek weet nie van die ander pastoor nie, maar my spirit is consume, my maand is consume with word of God. I confess it. I seek him with passion. And I feel that my anointing and my power is still weak. It is a tiny by wrestling. Ugh. Groanings. A prison. I'm in a prison. I want to break free. 
She started licking. I want to break free. <laughs> it's only those who wrestle with God that can obtain His glory and being set loose and where He saw. And He has good words. And it can be for me in 1 Timothy 6, verse 12. Too. Karen, lees jij van mij 2 Corinthians 13, vers 3 en 4. En die gaan weer terug naar 1 Timotheus 6 vers 12. Maar vers Karen. 2 Corinthians 3, 13, vers 3 en 4. Twee hier, twee hier, the Spirit of God. You are standing by this gate. All right. Since ye seek a proof of Christ speaking in me, you seek a proof of Christ speaking in me. Is it so? Why do you need that? You need a proof, is it? Eddie, when you speak of Christ, you seek a proof in me. You seek a proof in me. Thy proof is a report that I can test the gegaan it. The test say I get ge struggle, I get ge wrestle on my top time. This is how proof is coming. Which to you is not weak, but is mighty in you. All right. Okay. We need it to be mighty in us. That's why we obtain things by wrestling. For though he was crucified through weakness, yet he lived by the power of God. For we also are weak in him, but we shall live with him by the power of God toward you. We shall live by you. You want to see the power of God. I want to see the power of God. People want to see the proof that God is alive. God is living. He is a war maker van sy woord. En om heel dag net te loop en te sê, I believe, I believe, I believe. Oh boy. When you speak something, you will be tested to show if you truly believe what you are speaking. Denk jy dat ek preach en ek teach hier goed. En ek word nie getest van wat ek hier so sê nie. Ek word heel dag en al dag getoets om te kyk, do I truly believe it? Do I truly have faith in this? Do I truly want this? It's makkelijk om te sê, behold the sun. Maar Martin, do you behold me every day? Yes Lord, I want to behold you. Is jy gehoorzaam? Is jy altyd gehoorzaam? Do you have an ear? Yes, I have an ear. Ah, kom nie so. Jy teach. Resling. En die is weer mooi vir ons. 1 Timothy 6 vers 12, want hoor jy so. Naftali is a haan, a fine female deer, a mighty man, wants to let loose. And he has good, goodly words. Fight the good fight of the faith. Fight the good fight of faith. Lay hold of the eternal life to which you were summoned. Lay hold on eternal life which you are summoned. And you confess the good confession before many witnesses. Da is hy. Dit is so awesome. Lees weer die laaste stikkie. And? And you confess the good confession before many witnesses. Good. And you will have a good confession before many witnesses. Naftali. Will have goodly words. Can you hear it? Naftali, hear the baby that was born to us. He is so hind. What does it mean? It's stable. But he wants to be let loose. Ah, I see it's in the future. And his words shall be goodly. Dit het ons Genesis 49 vers 21 gelees. Nou lees Eddie, New Testament scripture. Lees het weer. Fight the good fight of the faith. Lay hold of the eternal life to which you were summoned. You are summoned. 
And you confess the good confession before many witnesses. And you confess what is goodly words is what they get proof it. Signore di Tuya, confess a report, a good, a good report, a good report. I have a good report. I have goodly words. I have goodly words, I have a good report that I have obtained it by wrestling with God this thing. Some things will come by wrestling and groaning. So come on, Skype. Go Skype more. You must behold the Son, Christ, all tight. Yara, what would you do? All tight. Jy moet gehoorzaam wees. You, have, you must have reference, reverence to God. He who has an ear to hear, only He can overcome. Are you in union with Him, in agreement with Him? Lord, this is what you have said, and I said my Amen on that. And then He will say, come in through the gate. Praise with your hands extended on high means, I surrender all. Did you, it you all is up here? But that mark your true worshiper. I surrender all. Praise and worship with your hands extended on high. In a worship, but out of your belly I come. Oh, that was my awesome Judah. Habitation. Verstaan dat dit is Hij in jou, maar jij in hom. Die kerk is vol mense wat sê, I've accepted the Lord Jesus Christ in me. But the problem is, there's no power. Maybe there's authority, but there's no power. Do you understand the difference? This is a cell phone. Hier is cell phone, as die batterij pap is, het hy geen power nie. Maar hy het die authority om banksake te doen, I have the authority on SMS to steer. I have the authority on everything to do. But as this battery pop is, it has no power. You need the power of God for them, this thing to function. The church have Christ in them. They have the authority. They can do everything, but they cannot do it without the power of God. You need to enter through these gates to have and to receive the glory and the power of God. To sit with him and rule. Reward. We know that God, you can yield it to this word. Are you content that he is your reward and he is alone? Judge. Judgment. Verstaan you that truth is important for you. As you are in a lie, you don't have to say that it is a rule. Because you are in a lie. Truth. And your confession is belangrijk. Truth is belangrijk. You're fortunate or you're brave. But bravery brings fortune. It's the spirit of God in you. You cannot fight for, for God if you are weak. You can't sit on your head and say, You have to judgment on people and you are weak. You can't sit on your head rule nie. Merry hearted. Now, oh, what happy hearted is a merry hearted. But you can know what soft the gears is. A soft heart is a merry hearted man. Means of what heart is, come down and see. Jesus soup means of a soft heart. You make compassionate views as you put. As means of say, I'm weak, I'm sick. But you passionate views. You make a soft heart day. Um, so I'm not going to consider the rule. You must, can you fight, can you lose your life? Are you willing to lose your life? Are you willing to wrestle with God for this thing? Are you willing to grow? Are you willing to be tested? Are you willing to prove yourself? Because men wants to see the good words. Men want to see the proof. The proof is in the pudding. May this bless you as you are going to groan. Ah, groan with God 
en reis over vir jou. Ek reis al baie jare met die Heere oor baie goed. Sekere goed gee vir my makkeliker, dis hoe jy, en ander goed vat 5 jaar, 10 jaar, betekker as het vir my geen na 10 jaar, dan heilig sommer van blijdskap, sê ek, Heere, hoekom nou hier? Maar dan kom ek achter, die revelation wat hy vir my gegeet, die ding wat hy vir my oopgebrek het, het deel geword van my, dit sit hier, dit is nie hier nie. I speak not here anymore, I'm speaking out of here because I've wrestled with God with this thing. Die Heere, die weet is vir het vir God. We gaan al punt kom, waar hy dan nie meer hoef te wrestle. Of course, and told the breaking of that. And talk Christ, and tell your feet are set loose. Dit kan wees, dat kan wees, sekere goed kan nie deurbreek en sekere goed nie. But what on soek, we want Christ, the sons of God, to be revealed. We want the daybreak. We want to fight and wrestle with God and say, we crown Lord for the sons of God to be manifested. We crown, we are in prison with death, set us loose, set us loose, set us loose, wrestle with God, until the breaking of day, until the light shines in a dark vessel, and the glory can shine, or the hind's feet are set loose, running, I've seen visions of me, first, ek het sikker so 10 jaar terug, a vision van my gehad, waar ek sien, een sekere prediker bid vir my en terwijl hy bid vir my val ek op die grond en toe ek op die grond val droom ek ek stuig en ek lees soos een kruis boe boe die grond, sweef ek so en ek sien as een kleed of glory wat so oor my haal hy is oranje geel en soos ek het nou vir jou verduid en ek sien ek het nog steeds en hy is 10 jaar terug droom en hy dit begin daar dit so te drip, ek glo, dit is anointing oil, en ilieskiele, kom daar baie uit, millions of millions of bees, en hulle gaan so raad vroem my, terwijl ek so le, gaan dit so, paar van hulle sluit my, paar gaan in my, en paar van hulle gaan recht dier my, en ek le so, en ek voel, soos een machine gun, van baie wat my dierboer, nou baie spreek altyd van wat, bevrugting, words, revelation, wat met bevrug, want baie, die symboliek van baie is bevrugting, but die woorde, kom onder uit die anointing uit, en ek staan op, en wat gebeur toe, ek begin hard loop, my feet is getting loose, oor die ek hard loop so vinnig, die stoele wat so in die kerk gestaan het, ek hard loop al die stoele onderste boog, So I wrestle with God and said, Lord, remember that vision of mine. Remember that anointing. Remember how you infiltrate. And I can feel the Lord me infiltrate with His word and His anointing with the drip on me. But I pray for Him to set my feet loose so that I can run the race for the one who the price must pay. It was all run, but only one wins the prize. Only those who wrestle with God. <coughs> May you be blessed today in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hoor jy, as jy dan in Genesis 49 gees,